thinking you must come up with tricks in well, in, in life to, to survive. <laughs> yeah. By 2016, I was a hot, 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 hot. <laughs> ah, then, no, 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 there you're untouchable now. Yeah. I've got this new mantra called, uh, 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 the motto called, uh, money must flow in abundance. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> it must go out as soon as it comes. Okay, let me check because it's there. Yeah. Anyway, sometimes I don't like to talk anymore, man. I like to show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Financially Incorrect, a podcast sponsored by FX Pesa. And today I, we have our first, I believe it's our first international guest um, all the way from South Africa and also our first um, Forex trader who's making his debut on Financially Incorrect. And his name is Dr. Ref Wayne. Yes. Um, he's here. Um, he's come in. Um, for those who don't know, Finance, FX Pesa, EGM Securities, is cele celebrated their fifth year in Kenya the day that we were making this, yeah. um, sure. uh, the day we were shooting this. So he's here to sort of um, be part of that celebration yeah. and talk about um, Forex trading. But today we're here to find out about his his money journey. I can say confidently that, um, at least as far as I know, mm -hmm. we have our first dollar millionaire, yes. Rand billionaire, definitely Kenyan yeah. billionaire yeah, on, yeah, the, yeah. On, the <laughs> on the podcast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm hoping some of that rubs off, rubs off on me yeah. um, and I can become a dollar, yes. dollar millionaire yeah, at the very yeah, least as well. Yeah. Um, so I'll let you introduce yourself. Um, yes. Maybe tell us a bit, a, a bit about yourself. Yeah. Um, starting with why you call yourself doctor. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I like when you say why you call yourself doctor. Actually, I didn't call myself. Uh, I'm not a self-appointed doctor. Yeah. I am a, a, a doctor who has been placed uh, by society. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. And specifically by an institution, I was honored with a doctorate. Oh, really? Uh, yes, because of my works that I've done uh, specifically in Forex as a whole. Yeah. And also in uh, philosophy. Okay, what yeah, institution? So, yeah, so I've got some books that I've written. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I've got actually three books now. I've got the mm -hmm. third one that's coming out. Mm -hmm. So someone was asking me, uh, what, where is your thesis? I say, uh, people don't understand that already when you write a book, mm -hmm in something and mm -hmm. it becomes uh, internationally known mm -hmm. and accepted mm -hmm. even by a naysayers mm -hmm. that means that is your thesis yes yes so i'm done with my thesis so i'm a doctor <laughs> <laughs> that is my thesis so if you are looking for my thesis my thesis is, is, is your is books because yeah. i was going to ask yeah. cause, i mean because i think the, the videos that I, I um i saw before this you'd say that i'm not a, i'm not a medical doctor but i'm a doctor of philosophy Ish. yeah okay um, yeah 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 so uh, so i'm trying to make so did, yeah. Did, did, yeah, did, because someone yeah. was saying i'm a medical doctor i had some people say hey man can you help me i've got a problem with my yeah I've got the medulla oblongata, I said, now this yeah. is not my language. <laughs> yeah. Tell me about the So yeah. I'm healing. If, if there's a healing that I'm doing, yeah. it's a healing, a financial healing. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm looking for people who are, 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 are having a disease yeah. uh, of poverty. Yeah. And I'm coming as a healer. So that is where so I you play the role of the doctor. So there was yeah. a doctor of philosophy, then you finally got the, the, the doctorate conferred upon you by an institution. Yeah. So before, yeah. uh, actually, find, find enough, when you talk about energy, I like what you yeah. said earlier on, you, you wish that as I'm a dollar millionaire, that you can also get some of them. Yeah. Uh, because from a long time ago, I've been believing in that. Because from a long time ago, from grade two, grade three, mm -hmm. third grade, fourth grade, I've been even calling myself a doctor. Yeah. There I was a self-appointed. <laughs> uh, so I attracted into my existence this name yeah. of a doctor. Yeah, yeah so it is in 2016 or 2017, mm -hmm. uh, there was two bi uh, biblical colleges mm -hmm. that said, actually, with what you've done, man. Mm -hmm. uh, in, 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 by the way, also in theology, I'm there. Oh, really? But that's a topic. <laughs> for <laughs> another G, day. There's a guy called the <laughs> G says, well, you like to say for another day. So yeah, yeah. it's a yeah. topic for another day. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So because of uh, I've also done some things. So when I talk about philosophy, uh, I'm talking about anthropology. Yeah, I'm talking about ontology. Yeah, I'm talking about epistemology. Yeah, I'm talking about etymology. Yeah. So this is all answers uh, the questions of why, how, when, by whom. I, 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 I'm, I've always just been in the journey. Okay. Yeah. And, and, and so these colleges, South Africa? South, South African Africa? colleges, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. So well, in, in congratulations for, yeah. for, for, yeah, for, yeah, your, yeah. for your doctorate. So, um, how, how, maybe I can just start because I guess this is predominantly going to be seen by a Kenyan audience. Yeah. Maybe I can just um, get people to understand exactly what you do. Mm -hmm. So how would you, what, what do you, how do you define what you do? So yeah. uh, 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 Forex trading is something that I did not know at all. Mm -hmm. uh, I only came to know it in 2011 mm -hmm. at the age of 16. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then even then it was a coincidence, but uh, I know better not to call things a coincidence. Mm -hmm. I know it was a divine appointment, mm -hmm. uh, but someone will say it was a coincidence. So basically mm -hmm. I dropped out of school mm -hmm. uh, in grade nine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I dropped out of school because I was like, you know what, the situation of ho at home is mm -hmm. just not doing it. Mm -hmm. uh, let me drop out of the school, but I'm not dropping out. So people, when they, so someone I saw recently say, hey, you know what, Dr. Refuin dropped out, I'm also gonna drop out. Mm -hmm. But I did not drop out just to drop out. Mm -hmm. I dropped out with a plan. Mm -hmm. 
So, uh, and my first plan was that, okay, I'm going to raise funds mm -hmm. and eventually use those funds to start a business. Mm -hmm. So what was the one of the ways I was raising funds? Mm -hmm. I started looking onto the internet for what is called, actually, we're at the age of 16, 17, eight, actually from age 16 or any other age, even mm -hmm. till today, people who are graduates, it's not easy to get a job. Mm -hmm. So people don't know that if you don't have a job, there's already jobs out there that are called network marketing. Yes. So multi-level marketing is yeah. something that is uh, looked upon down mm -hmm. and, you know, but honestly speaking, it is one of the best opportunities in the world. Mm -hmm. uh, as long as you got the best product, mm -hmm. you, do, you mustn't uh, do a multi-level marketing of a... a of, of things that are not there. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so you need to have a, yeah, you need to have a product. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you need to have a product uh, and you know there's have a life, there's yeah. American way, M way. There's a lot of multi-level yeah. uh, marketing companies that are still yeah. here for uh, hundreds of years. Some, yeah. yeah, so uh, uh, so I was looking for one of that. Unfortunately, I went to one that was not legit, mm -hmm. but it helped me a lot. So it wasn't legitimate in the it sense was of not the, legit. the, the yeah, product. I, I came later to say that this, is, this thing was <laughs> it's not legit. You know, when you find out later, that, hey, you know what? Yeah. What I was selling here was not legit. Yeah. So basically, I was selling SIM cards. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, SIM cards. So start, you see, uh, this, what is it? You yeah. know, it's called Vodafone. Yeah, Vodafone, I don't yeah, know, yeah. 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 yeah so Airtel, I was selling yeah. that thing in the streets. Yeah. Yeah, saying, hey man, uh, you can leave your network. Join this one, and mm. then so uh, basically, when you sell a certain level, because you know, multi level marketing is a multi level. So, what is multi level? It is uh, different levels. Mm -hmm. So, the first level, uh, uh, I was, uh, what, what was the name of the distributor? Mm -hmm. The first level, you are the distributor. Mm -hmm. You are the small guy now mm -hmm. starting up. Then, the second level, you become what is called a trainer. Mm -hmm. Then, the third level, you become what is called a S man, assistant mm -hmm. manager. Mm -hmm. Then, the fourth level, you become what is so called a owner. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, so I was selling that. So there are different campaigns. Uh, I was selling SIM cards. Other people were selling insurance. Other mm -hmm. people were selling. So I, I chose a one of SIM cards. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I was selling SIM cards. Mm -hmm. I was selling SIM cards. So that is where now I gained confidence. People today, they say, Revoin is full of energy. He's a talkative guy. People do not know that I'm actually an introvert. Mm -hmm. um, uh, the most shy person that you'll ever meet. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, very, very quiet. But uh, when I see the mic, I'm excited because I was trained like that, you know. <laughs> yeah, I was trained like that. Yeah. Yeah. So that is where uh, my journey began. Okay. My journey began in multi-level marketing. Yeah. As I was selling the SIM cards now, mm -hmm. this SIM card, I met a gentleman called uh, David Schwartz, a mm -hmm. white man. Mm -hmm. One of my customers on the streets, because mm -hmm. we're selling on the streets here. It's yeah. not even at a shop. Yeah. I was even wishing to sell in the shop, because yeah. in the shop you are more... Uh, but in the streets, you are less, like, this guy is trying, ask, asking for money, is a mm -hmm. thief. Mm -hmm. So it's not easy to sell. So I, I sold to the guy called David Schwartz, the mm -hmm. white man. Mm -hmm. And he was the guy who asked me a question. Then, what are you doing here mm -hmm. at this age? Mm -hmm. uh, how old are you? I said, 16. He said, what are you doing here on the streets? I said, no, I left school, but don't worry. I'm going to be doing something big one day. Mm -hmm. And he just liked my optimism, mm -hmm. my uh, positive energy, mm -hmm. how I created him. He was like, mm -hmm. man, uh, come and see me at my office. Take mm -hmm. this thing. Mm -hmm. uh, he gave me a business card. That is my journey. Then, mm -hmm. then, uh, so now him, he was a trader. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was a trader. So now. he was your introduction yeah. to trading. So he was my and him, he was calling me to the office so that he can use me also as a salesman to sell some of his uh, products as well. Mm -hmm. uh, like mm -hmm. his classes, mm -hmm. you know. And yeah, he was also doing insurance. But <laughs> me, I was then drawn into the trading. The trading. And okay. I, I want to do this thing. Okay. Yeah. So that was no. your introduction to yeah, trading. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I can yeah, take I you want, back yeah, a little in yeah. terms of your, your, your his, history in a linear yeah. scale, um, what was money like for you mm -hmm. at home yeah. um, um, in those first years? Uh, what, what was money, money like? It's uh, at home uh, till today, by the way, but be, be me being me and uh, I, I feel like I, I broke the financial case uh -huh. or generational case uh -huh. because of now money, it's supposed to, when you have $100, uh -huh. it's supposed to last three months. Uh -huh. So uh, in that way, there's a limited uh, mindset of money. Uh -huh. So money and because of circumstance, by the way, uh -huh. because of uh, my mom, I, I, okay, maybe my brother, because he's here, maybe he, he's seen her work. I, I've never seen her work. Uh, I think she has to, used to have a company. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm seeing employed, formerly employed. So mm -hmm. she's been someone uh, working from home, doing something, uh, peace job, small mm -hmm. job. Yeah, so money was very limited. Mm -hmm. As I say, $100. Hey, it must last for three months. And when I say three months... And what, yeah, what, are, the, what <laughs> are the expenses there? Yeah, yeah, $100 three is months lasting three months. Hey, so. it must last for that's three months. Because that's what... I'm pushing it. Maybe it's my phone, man. Maybe let's say four. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, three months is... Yo, 
because of now everything must be you know yeah like hey, so you living on yeah, 20, yeah, yeah, 20, yeah, yeah. 20 25 yeah, 20 yeah, yeah, 20 yeah, yeah. 25 30 dollars anyway, inflation now maybe a now month. i will say 300 dollars must last because at the time 100 dollar was something of course yeah, yeah 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 so but it must last it must last when you take out 10 dollars yeah uh, it, it must really really last okay tell me yeah. in this three months four months that you're you're, mm-hmm. you're saying this hundred dollars must last where is that money being spent uh, well okay in break, the house, it, break likely, that break down the hundred dollars like, yeah, from, yeah. from a big family yeah uh, it's only me and my mom at the time mm-hmm. uh, my brother was staying somewhere else so okay. at least uh, I, I'm only with my mom. So we are the only okay. two people. Okay. So, yeah, bread is, must be there. Maize meal must be there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the basics must be there. Mm-hmm. Porridge must be done in mm-hmm. the morning. Jungle oats. I don't know if mm-hmm. you've got oats here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, you know, uh, 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 even Kellogg's is a luxury. Mm-hmm. Kellogg's a luxury. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Conflicts is a very, very serious luxury. You yeah. don't touch the... Yeah. Don't even mention that yeah. you want uh, conflicts. Yeah. You understand the situation. So I understand that time that, okay, the situation here, it's not... Uh, uh, it's not go- uh, uh, and I don't see this happening uh, for a long time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I don't want this thing to. I, I couldn't imagine myself this thing carrying on for for years to come. Yeah, I think that is one of the reasons why I dropped out of school. Yeah, I didn't drop out of school because of uh, I was a, a, a small cow. What I was doing, naughty yeah. stuff, no, yeah. because of the situation that. Uh, this thing is not gonna last. Yeah. <laughs> so I just want to ask you a little bit about. Um, I mean, you've talked about the sort of difficult um, position that you were in in terms of money at that time. I want to ask about the. F- in your memory now, when was the first time you mm-hmm. consciously um, thought to yourself as a child, mm-hmm. this is a money problem. Mm-hmm. Like this is a lack of, 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 um, of, of resources. Mm-hmm. And if I had, mm-hmm. or if we had, if we as a family mm-hmm. had more money, mm-hmm. our situation would be different. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, well, for me, it was very simple to spot the difference. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, when um, you are wearing a de- dirty clothes, mm-hmm. even when something becomes dirty on mm-hmm. you, you won't notice the difference. Mm-hmm. But me, I would notice the difference very easy because of now, I spoke about I was staying with my mom. Mm-hmm. I didn't talk about my dad. Mm-hmm. So my dad is a, one of the first uh, and the top IT specialists in the mm-hmm. country, in South Africa. Mm-hmm. That is where I take my computer genes from mm-hmm. now. Yeah, so uh, yeah, he's a computer genius. Mm-hmm. So now, uh, I would spend some time with him, mm-hmm. and I can see that okay, uh, yeah, he's pushing, mm-hmm. he's pushing, he's doing well. Of mm-hmm. course, he's got a family, mm-hmm. uh, but I could see that okay, he's pushing. So uh, when I'm with him, even though it can be for a day or two, mm-hmm. and I go back home, ah, mm-hmm. uh-uh, I know that, that, uh, that is the first <laughs> sign that no, yeah. I need to. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's, a, there's a paradigm shift. Yes. Mm. So it's easy to spot it now. Yeah. Mm. Very easy to spot. So I, I like mm. some kids who don't really notice that where they are, mm-hmm. it's not sup- where they're supposed to be mm-hmm. because they've been growing up like that. They mm-hmm. don't know any better. Mm-hmm. So I could see better. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So my dad is not a millionaire or was not a millionaire at that time, but he's earning well, he's doing well, mm-hmm. and he's, yeah. So uh, I can see that no, 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 no. We can go to a restaurant called McDonald's. Mm-hmm. We're going to, yeah. And then when I go home, I'm like, yeah, okay, of course it's gonna give me something. Okay, mm-hmm. hey, uh, son, see you soon. Mm-hmm. Take take something like mm-hmm. this, of course. Mm-hmm. Hey, but I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm hungry now. He was yeah. making me hungry. Yeah. So if the first person who inspired me, yeah. I must give him the credit. Yeah. Dad. <laughs> so so in mm. relation to so because I'm assuming if your dad, if my assumption and you can correct me if I'm wrong, is your your dad being a computer genius, yeah. um, working, he's gone through school. He went through formal yeah, yeah, school. Yeah, 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 he's a, yeah. He's a graduate. He's an academic. He's went through formal school. Yeah. yeah. So I'm wondering. So when you're in um. I don't know if it's grade nine grade or you, nine, you yeah. when you're in grade mm-hmm. nine, um, why not be like, mm-hmm. you know what, I want to push through yes. and f- follow the path yeah. that my dad took yeah. in terms of the academic journey and mm-hmm. then I will achieve success. Mm-hmm. Why the deviation to be like, no, 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 no. And I need to solve the situation mm-hmm. now. So let me find out and let me find other ways of beginning to generate revenue mm-hmm. from like grade nine mm-hmm. rather than trying to go through the same process your dad uh, went through. As a matter of fact, mm-hmm. uh, already by grade seven, mm-hmm. Uh, grade 7, let me just say 2009, 2010, during the time of the World Cup, mm-hmm. I was making money mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, at home, at mm-hmm. school, I'm mm-hmm. making money, I'm going to school, I was making money, I was doing what is called, what is called today as dropshipping. Mm-hmm. I'm one of the first people to do it before it was called dropshipping. At mm-hmm. the time, it was even illegal mm-hmm. to sell something that you don't have. Mm-hmm. So I'm a pioneer also of dropshipping, mm-hmm. at least in Africa, because of, mm-hmm. I would sell you something over the internet on eBay and everything. Mm-hmm. Once you order it and send me the money, mm-hmm. the truth is that I don't even have that thing. <laughs> I'm going to quickly go and buy <laughs> that thing. So, mm-hmm. 
So you see that I've, I've already been coming with uh, with ways. So what were you my, selling at that point? Cell phones, mostly cell phones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To you, uh, classmates, yeah. schoolmates. Uh, no, no, no. Online. I don't. Even, people they don't even need to know me. Mm -hmm. Online. You know the online thing. I come from far with online. So online business is the best business in the world because mm -hmm. you don't need to meet anyone. Mm -hmm. You can do it. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I was doing it online. You just go. Even today you can do it. Now it's even legal now. Uh, although some commerce don't want it, mm -hmm. uh, drop shipping, uh, but mm -hmm. I know that like uh, shop, shops like uh, Shopify that mm -hmm. allow it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just go there and list a product that, that you don't have, mm -hmm. uh, and then you make a deal with the supplier to mm -hmm. say, I'm going to sell this thing for $200, uh, and then uh, you, I'm going to give you $150, mm -hmm. send it out, $50 is coming to me. Mm -hmm. So it's a business that is completely legal now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, drop shipping. So I was doing it at the time. I was I, I was pushing mostly cell phones. Yeah, yeah. And was that the first money that you made for yourself? Yeah, I no no. There I made the real money. Yeah. I don't want to lie to you. When I say real money, fifty dollars, I could get it in a week. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 BlackBerry, Sony Xperia, uh, uh, BlackBerry Torch. Uh, uh, this one. Uh, hey, no 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 no. Where were you getting the phone? Where were you getting the phones? The phones. I don't want to lie to you. Uh, I didn't have any plan to get them. So <laughs> I would go. <laughs> Hey, I was taking serious risk there. Yeah. Actually, at one point, uh, 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 one guy even pointed me with a finger to yeah. say, hey, don't try that again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because he wanted his stuff. No. So I was looking for a customer who's very patient. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to say, hey, man, uh, maybe I would say, hey, I'll come up with tricks uh, anyway. Uh, and by the way, there are positive things. Uh, mm -hmm. But when you look at them, someone can say, hey, uh, hey, this is something wrong. Yes. But uh, truly speaking, you must come up with tricks in, one, <laughs> in life to, to survive. <laughs> yeah. So I was saying, no, you know what? Uh, right now, my supplier is still in Dubai. He's coming. Ladies, mm. in the airport is jammed. Please mm -hmm. give me four days. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm now looking. <laughs> I'm looking for a bargain now. Mm -hmm. I've got the money in my account. I'm looking for the bargain. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to uh, uh, I'm gonna go to people. So what I do is that uh, because at that time, there was no re the supplier uh, like today, there's suppliers mm -hmm. now that work with dropshippers. Mm -hmm. I would now look for people who have that phone mm -hmm. and then negotiate with them to say, hey man, send me this phone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go send me this phone. So what a second-hand product. Yeah, yeah, it's a second-hand and refurbished. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes I have to change it. <laughs> 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 sometimes I have to change the screen. Hey guys, uh -huh. you must survive. <laughs> sometimes I have to change the screen mm -hmm. and make it look But nice. are, you yeah. are you telling the purchaser this? It's at my own discretion. Mm -hmm. yes. So as far as, as far as the purchase is concerned, he's uh, buying and he's getting a new phone. He's getting a new phone as far as it's concerned however when he gets the phone mm. indeed it does look real it's fine actually mm. the phone is fine i mm. want to lie to you you would never spot uh, uh, even me i've bought someone from someone just two years ago someone mm. scammed me today i call it a scam mm. i was buying a brand new phone but i see this is a second hand phone yeah yeah you see now it came back to me now that's yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah but now and uh, me those ones you wouldn't see that they're second hand as a matter of fact some 90 percent knew that it's second hand but some people who think it's brand new, but they can see it doesn't have a box. Mm. This thing, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah and how? Yeah, so yeah. let me say, if if I was buying a phone mm -hmm. um, from someone and um, from someone and they give me um, uh, a phone out of a box, I would yeah. think that it's either been stolen yeah. or something of the sort. Like I think yeah. that it's, ah, it's, it's, a, it's a hot phone. Yeah, no, 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 so, no. That one uh, uh, we were playing very far from yeah. stolen. Yeah. I, I really wanted the box, uh, although you can see it's not sealed. Everything yeah. it doesn't have accessories. Even like the charger, you can see this charger. Mm. It's not matching with any of the phone. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, everything is just mixed up. No, no, no. Really, when it comes to stolen, it's only in one occasion someone tried to now scam me with a stolen one. But that one, I could see because me as a computer guy myself, I checked the email, mm -hmm. email number. Mm -hmm. uh, I still remember the number star hash 66 or something. Mm -hmm. Star hash something. And it shows you the email number. Mm -hmm. The email number, you can check it if it's blacklisted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, 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 no. Hey, that one I was playing very far because I understand that. Hey, that one, mm -hmm. I didn't want to play in mm -hmm. the dangerous thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. I just want to make money. I'm young. Yeah. I'm scared. I'm very scared. I'm yeah. a very big coward. Yeah. I don't want trouble. I just want to make something. Some money. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So essentially, <laughs> that, that period is mm -hmm. when you decide for yourself mm -hmm. that I want to make money. I want to yeah. make a lot of money. I want to make money. Um, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And uh, I want to make it now. I don't want to wait, go through university to mm -hmm. sort of make it at a point. Yes, I, I, in the beginning, I don't want to lie to you. I was willing to go through university. Mm -hmm. I wanted to go through university, but... I don't know. I, I, I had what is called now an awakening. Like, I was like, you know what? I, I just couldn't wait mm. for it anymore. I was very, like, in the beginning, I was like, because I wanted to be a, a cybersecurity specialist, mm -hmm. uh, even, even maybe study ethical hacking mm -hmm. or study programming mm -hmm. or study. Okay, there were three things I wanted to study programming, mm -hmm. number mm -hmm. one. Number two, I wanted to study psychology, mm -hmm. uh, especially uh, criminal psychology. Mm -hmm. I, I'm very interested in the how, when, who shot this person, who came, how. Mm -hmm. 
who came? You can't just say you don't know. Mm-hmm. Let's check. Yeah, criminal. So I was obsessed with uh, this uh, shows mm-hmm. that shows people how they entered. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, but uh, yeah. So uh, a detective I wanted to do maybe, mm-hmm. uh, and the third one uh, I wanted to do uh, neuroscience. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I wanted to understand more about the brain. Mm. Yeah, what really controls the brain? Yeah. What's going on in the brain? Yeah. So, but they, I, I unfortunately, I couldn't go, uh, do all these things now formally. Yes. I end up studying them on my own now, okay. just reading books and everything. Yeah. Okay. So I, I, I wanted to go to university, but yeah. it, somehow I... I just something one day I just like hey, you know what yeah. I can't can't can't, can't yeah, wait. Okay, can't so I want to talk a bit about the investment that you then make into your career. And mm-hmm. by investment, I'm looking at um, one: is there any cash that you put in? Did you have taken any trading? Mm-hmm. Or even if it's in terms of time, how much time did you spend mm-hmm. um, studying mm-hmm. um, forex trading? Yeah. Um, um, before you really got into it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, uh, uh, my mentor, David Schwartz, when he was saying I must sell insurance for him or look for customers and everything, mm-hmm. me, I then told him that I want to do what you are doing because all the time when I come to you to submit, uh, you know, people who join or whatever, mm-hmm. he's always on the laptop. Mm-hmm. Or he's, there's graphs there. Yeah. So I want to know more. Then he gave me a book, uh, this book, of a guy called William Gunn. Mm-hmm. Yeah, William Gunn is the father of technical analysis. Mm-hmm. Hey. Yeah, so yeah, so he gave me a book, the best book at the time. I did not know, mm-hmm. and I went home and I studied the book. Mm-hmm. I read the book. So uh, personally, I I, I I I I put a lot of hours, mm-hmm. a lot of hours. So uh, when it comes to investment, people don't understand that uh, investment ca- is different. Mm-hmm. Me, because I did not have the money, mm-hmm. I invested something though, which mm-hmm. is what energy. Mm-hmm. I invested time. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. So uh, in exchange of that, you can invest money. Mm-hmm. So uh, people don't understand that you can invest either three things, time, energy, or money. Mm-hmm. So I invested a lot of energy and time in studying this thing, mm-hmm. studying this thing. I don't have the money, I don't have anything, but studying this thing, day mm-hmm. more. Each and every single day, mm-hmm. I used to be obsessed. When I say obsessed, Obsessed to eleven, my mom says, "No, no, no, sleep. It's three o'clock. You're still on the computer. No, leave this thing, man. You know." Uh, mm-hmm. But I'm obsessedly. I, I was obsessed in in understanding what mm-hmm. really th- mm-hmm. uh, drives the market. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I put a lot of hours. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I put a lot of hours I- I- in in this thing. Mm-hmm. So then, when did mm-hmm. you? When did when, when between um, the moment you get that book mm-hmm. and when you actually start trading? Yeah. What's mm-hmm. what's the time frame? Maybe uh, it took me uh, three months now to mm-hmm. go to the real account. Mm-hmm. Now. Yeah, yeah. It took me about three months. Mm-hmm. So uh, I, I was I was putting a lot of work, but demo, mm-hmm. I was pushing demo, yeah. blowing it, blowing demo, blowing demo, mm-hmm. blowing demo. And then after three months, I was like, you know what? Uh, I, you know what? Let me just go for a real account. Yeah. Here. Uh-huh. Uh, and, yeah and, and, and so when you start trading, are there no, or were there no um, um, age limitations or age restrictions at the time? Yeah, there is yeah. uh, age restriction until today. Uh, so I used my mom's uh, details. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, to register. Yeah. Yeah, I used my uh, mom's so details. you used your mom's details. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm nowhere in the trading. platform there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They, 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 it, I'm no, I'm not appearing anywhere yeah. in, in the trading platform. Yeah. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, it's the old woman uh, who's, yeah, who's, who's trading. trading. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And um, so, where do you get your first um, mm. bit of income to then mm. start real trading? So my first income, I got it from a, a gentleman called a, a Shumani. Mm-hmm. Is my it was my friend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Shumani. Now I'm coming with him from multi level marketing. Mm-hmm. And then uh, he he's a smart guy. He's mm-hmm. also yeah yeah he's he's smart. He's academic. And mm-hmm. uh, when I left the multi level marketing, mm-hmm. I also told him that I'm leaving. Mm-hmm. And he believed in me a lot, so he gave me fifty dollars, mm-hmm. yeah, to start. However, it didn't last for a day. Mm-hmm. And the fifty dollars <laughs> was blown away. Yeah yeah right, yeah. Right. So Matt, I must give him credit for that. Mm-hmm. He did give me the fifty dollars. And then uh, after blowing the money, mm-hmm. we continued again. Now me and him on the demo, mm-hmm. on the demo, mm-hmm. on the demo, on the demo. And then I then I was like, you know what, uh, you know what, this thing. Okay, I'm learning it myself. Uh, I'm doing well on demo, but I'm blowing. Mm-hmm. Uh, I need to go to someone who's really teaching this thing. Mm-hmm. You see, mm-hmm. yeah. I'm, uh, so I then went back to my mentor to say. Tell me more about this thing. Like, mm-hmm. you know, you are doing this thing also. Show me. Mm-hmm. You know, because he was reluctant in the beginning because mm-hmm. he wanted to me to be an employee mm-hmm. and everything. But I don't want those things. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but I mean, show me, show me. So he was then taking me in. I want to show you uh, a technical analysis. He was showing me technical analysis, but it was mostly in fundamental analysis. That mm-hmm. is where, why today I'm very strong in fundamentals. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He was teaching me, teaching me, teaching me, teaching me. Then I approached then uh, 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 my aunt. Mm-hmm. Yeah. My aunt, uh, my mom's sister. Mm-hmm. I then made a meeting with my aunt her daughter mm-hmm. and her son. Mm-hmm. I said, I want to have a meeting with you guys. Actually, I wanted to have a meeting with my aunt alone, but mm-hmm. she came in the meeting with the kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and then to say, hey, 
please guys, can you fund me? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so my auntie then uh, changed my life because uh, then she funded me with at least $500. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so she funded me. And was this $500 mm-hmm. that you're giving back to her? Or was it $500 like, you know, here's like a, a gift? You uh, know, well, you I asked uh, me in, initially, mm-hmm. I was saying, no, uh, give me. I, don't, I can't remember the agreement. Cause I like your question because mm-hmm. I can't remember <laughs> was she giving me or what. Yeah. However, she told me that she's giving me, mm-hmm. you see. Mm-hmm. But in my mind, I wanted to. Paid back. Yeah, I don't like actually give, getting money just yeah. like that. I yeah. want to pay it back, yeah. you see. Yeah. But she gave it to me wholeheartedly. Yeah. Say, son, take this money. Yeah. Um, do whatever. Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Son, take this money, do whatever. I was even shocked then. Then she gave me that. And then the daughter, mm-hmm. after the meeting, mm-hmm. gave me also a call to say, I also want to give you something. Mm-hmm. But she was like, no, mm-hmm. I want to yeah, put something mm-hmm. there. Maybe you mm-hmm. can grow it. You mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So then I had, I, I think I ended up with $700. The mm-hmm. daughter gave me 200 mm-hmm. USD. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So then you start. Mm-hmm. So then you start. Ah, then I went full force. Now. Okay. Ah, now there you When do you, fu- you make your first your, your first money? Yeah, first money. So there was a, 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 a NFP mm-hmm. uh, on that Friday. Mm-hmm. So I put in, okay, I had $700. Mm-hmm. The truth, the, now you are knowing, now this exclusive only you, $100, I took it now. Yeah. I, first thing, I, I, I chew the money. $100, $100 I, I want to pay myself. Yeah. <laughs> I want to thank myself. <laughs> yeah, so you have $600 left. I, $100, I said to my friend, hey yeah. man, let's go out. Yeah. Let's have fun, man, hey, let's chill. This is hey. Ashum, man. Yeah, Ashum, 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 I said, man, let's go out, let's chill. He didn't even understand where the money, I don't even know till today if he knows where that money was coming. Maybe yeah. he even thought this guy <laughs> stole money. I don't know what, he took, yeah. the money comes from, but I said, man, let's go. And has uh, fun. So uh, we started with there's a mall called Santin Mall. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we went there. I said, hey, why, "What do you want?" He said, "He wants a watch. Mm. He likes watch. Yeah, mm. watch. Yeah, watch is like thirty dollars. Yeah, mm. is this you know shiny watch? But mm. after some time, you can see that uh, it's not. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but right. something, man. You know, something like that. We went to. I remember we drank um, mango juice. Mm. Yeah, we went. We just had you had a good, you had a good day. Yeah, you had yeah, a good yeah, time. It's, it's a good thing. I mean, yeah. wow, what a yeah. what a great thing, man. Yeah. Hey, wow, we scored a big, the big score. Yeah, this was a big score. Yeah, we scored. Big yeah. So and then I gave him the other hundred USD. Okay. So I had five hundred USD for myself. So I said, okay. when you go and fund mm-hmm. your account, mm-hmm. I'll fund here. Yeah. Yeah. So NFP, we came together and then we traded NFP. Mm-hmm. Yeah. At the, there's a broker at that time uh, uh, where we went to the broker's mm-hmm. office and then we traded at the broker's office. Mm-hmm. Uh, they were they were doing like now this broker's they do FOMC, NFP, PPI. You know mm-hmm. they meet just meet guys and trade together. So mm-hmm. we traded there. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that is where we made something. Yeah, but I was using small lots, mm-hmm. using small lots. But mm-hmm. yeah, I was starting to see. You know, you know when you start making that small amount. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I was, so I was what was the what was the um, um, first big amount that you made and how long did it take you? Uh, that day on itself, the yes. hundred, uh, uh, that day on uh, NFP, yeah. I think we made fifty uh, percent. Uh, Shumani made uh, fifty dollars mm-hmm. on my side. I, 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 on my, I'm, I'm, I'm very aggressive, by mm-hmm. the way. Yeah, yeah. Even though I say small lot, small lot to me, maybe I think zero point zero one. Small yeah. lot is for me, it's one lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> it's, not, it's not. A, it's relative. Right. The small lot. Yeah, right, yeah. Right, right, right. Me, I'm like I. I'm going all out. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm going all out too. Uh, uh, so I made about two hundred dollars or something. So I even doubled my account. Mm. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you put hundred dollars, put hundred dollars. Mm. Yeah, I always left something behind because remember I, last time I put fifty dollars, I blew. Yeah. I was like, no, I need to always leave something yeah. behind. Yeah, yeah, always don't put. And it's an advice I must give everyone right now who are watching mm. this that don't put all your money in the forex account. Mm. No, put just twenty percent of it. I mean, if you're a good trader, you'll grow it up to the. To the capital yeah. that, yeah. yeah. Sometimes you might not even need to yeah. put all of it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. And so the money that you're taking for yourself, how are mm. you spending it? How are you how are you meeting your your are you still living at home at this point? Or I'm have you moved my out? Mom. I'm still with my so you have mom. no yeah, rent yeah, costs. Yeah, yeah. Do you have any food costs? Yeah, Do you yeah, have yeah, any yeah. costs that so you're So my mom in? now uh, 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 um she just seeing me coming at home to say, Hey, please uh, uh, they're gonna you're gonna get a call from the broker. Just say yes. If you can get a call, yeah. <laughs> mm. Yeah, just say yes because mm. she would answer. You're trading in, in her name, funny enough, I I tell her. Hey, I'm using your details of the broker here. Yeah. But she will, they will call her, hey, we can see you are trading. Are you the one who opened your... Hey. She will say, no, I don't know anything about this thing. <laughs> so, but now you're killing me. Yeah. <laughs> so they end up now freezing. You see, I said, but what's happening? I said, no, it's me. Mm-hmm. I don't know why I told you about this. Oh, mm-hmm. it's you. Go ahead now. Hey, where's the king? Nah, I forgot. Get the fraud. It's a fraud stars. You mm. know, I thought it's a fraud mm. stars. Mm. So no, it's mm. me. So mm. I said, you know, if you get a call from the bank, yes. whatever you are getting, anything, just yes. say yes yes, 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 yes. Put the money in. <laughs> yes. We just want to see the withdrawal. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. So yeah, yeah. So I said to her, there's money coming. How much? How much is it? I said, I. 
relax. My name is Kami. You see, uh, my name is Kami. <laughs> my name is Kami. Uh-huh. Relax. So you yeah, how, how is the money being yeah. spent now? Yeah, yeah. So I, I then said, you know what? Okay, she did. A, she pulled the stand. The first money I remember. Mm. Uh, I don't know how much. It was fifty dollars. I don't know how much, but there's some money that uh, it came in. She didn't tell me. You <laughs> see, she came in back. Hey, money is in. I just saw her. Hey, the very nice. Yes, yes. Yeah. Going out. She left the whole day. Maybe she came later. That thing gave us big problems. Yes. Hey. Between in your relationship. Hey. Yes. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. hey, she came with something for me. I think she bought me some uh, pie or something. I said, hey, man. <laughs> what is As it? As if that's to bribe me. This yeah. pie. I said, man, need the real money. That, <laughs> <laughs> that you made. Yeah. I, I said, oh, you know what? The, the trick here is gonna, I'm going to take the card and mm. hold the card with mm. me. Mm. Yeah, take all the card. Because uh, at one point I was thinking maybe I'm going to change the names and use someone's details. But I was like, ah. Uh, it's you, better for my uh, mom. Yeah, regardless if there's of, anyone who's going to take the money, it's, let it's it better be my mom. Yeah, yeah, let yeah, it be my yeah. mom. You see, so, so do you get into like an agreement with her? No, I'm like, you know what? To her, how you, you know what? Mm. Uh, 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 the card. Mm. Give me the card. Mm. Let me hold the card. Yeah, mm. let me hold the card. The money when it comes in, me, I've got the card. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to go out immediately to the ATM. Mm. Have cash. Yeah, mm. have cash. Yeah, have so are you cash. giving her like 10%, 20%? Uh, honestly speaking, I was not giving her money, but <laughs> however, mm. no, but however, mm. uh, 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 we were using these big TVs. You know these big TVs that have a thing? Mm. They think at the back, I, yeah. I, I, I bought the plasma mm. TV. I put the satellite. Mm. I painted the house. I put windows. Oh, so you were taking care of things Yeah, no, I don't lie to you. Uh, uh, I was, 90% of the money mm. was just going back to, because I'm young anyway, and I want this like Zara stuff. Mm. I, I bought a laptop for myself. I bought a laptop. Mm. Yeah, I bought a laptop. I bought a cell phone. Mm. Yeah, with my withdrawals, because I was withdrawing every week. So, mm. yeah, because I was starting to say, you know what, I want to have a, a goal of just making $50. Mm. Yeah, $50. In the beginning, it was $50 per week. Mm. Then it went to $50 per day. Mm. Yeah, $50 per day. Yeah. $50 per day. Yeah. 250 USD yeah. per week. Yeah, if I yeah. hit a target. So, the, the second thing again is to have a target. You must yeah. have a target. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Mm. So, so essentially, you're saying in terms of your living costs, in terms mm. of rent or food, your mom is still meeting those mm-hmm. costs. It's not you who's meeting those yeah. costs. And you're spending mm. um, all the money you're making. You're spending it on renovating the house or, or, or yes. things on yourself. Even food, investment, even food, some even food. food yeah, I don't right. like even food. Yeah. Even food. I was. Actually, I started becoming now the head of the house. At yes, that age. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In a way, because I was taking over everything now. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Even when my mom was used to hustle, doing surveys online, yeah. everything. Nah, she stopped a lot of things. Now. And are you keeping? Mm. Are you keep? Are you investing in anything else at that point? I'm not investing in anything. Anything. In, in yeah. anything. Yeah. I'm Do you, are you setting up a savings anything. account or anything? There's sort? no savings. It's hand to mouth. When is the that, money comes in, is it and you that move. day? Okay. Does that ever change? Yeah. Do you then, or rather, when? Because mm. I'm assuming now there's yeah. some sort of savings yeah. um, that sort of kicks mm. in. How mm. long does it take mm. for that for you to get to that stage of your life? Yeah. yeah. So now from, from there, uh, okay, I'm starting to change. I'm starting to change. Like mm. I'm starting to change now. Mm. Uh, I'm starting to change. Like you know when you change. The clothes are changing. The language changes. Money just comes with it. It's, a diff, it's an energy that changes the person, mm-hmm. either for the bad or for mm-hmm. the for the worst. Mm-hmm. It changed me for, I mean, even either for the good or, or the, the worst. Yeah, yeah. Me, it changed me for the good. Mm-hmm. Uh, it made me now. Or oh, if 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 there was ever an investment that I made at that age, mm. I was buying books. Mm. Yeah, I I I used to go to a, a shop called Exclusive Books. Mm-hmm. I used to buy books, mm-hmm. books. Yeah, books. I was not investing in anything shares mm-hmm. or wara wara. I mm-hmm. was buying books. Mm. Yeah, and then I bought a book uh, called The Secret. Mm. Yeah, called the secret mm. yeah, of Ronda Bain. Mm. Yeah, so that book changed my life. Then mm. it speaks about uh, 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 the yeah, power. Yeah, of yeah you know it. Ah, yeah, 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 yes, yeah, 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 yeah. When yeah. I saw that book, yeah. I was like, yo. So okay, it's, it's clear that I'm attracting things into my life. Mm-hmm. Let me now consciously start to manifest mm. my life now. Mm. Uh-huh. Then I started to do affirmations. Now I started mm. to uh, do declar- declarations mm-hmm. now. Mm-hmm. 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 And then that is where I started now to think of saving. Mm-hmm. Yeah, saving. Mm-hmm. Start, yeah, now, no, that thing. So my, how my, old my, are you at this yeah, Now I'm growing. Now as 17, 18, 19. Uh, 19, my life changed now. Yeah. Yeah. So 19 is when you you're see, discovering yeah, the secret, yeah, the power yeah, of attraction. Yeah, 19, my life. No, no, yeah. no. I discovered the secret even longer. But now, uh, there's a, a book of Napoleon Hill also. Um, I, 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 you know, Napoleon Hill, there's two books uh, of, that he wrote as well. Mm. He's also heavy, that guy. Mm. Napoleon Hill. <laughs> yeah, Napoleon Hill and, uh, and also Jim Rohn. Yeah. And also El Shouf and mm. also... Um, uh, yeah, this uh, yeah, Billy Siligani and mm-hmm. another, another gentleman. I remember his name as well. So these people changed my life. So I was mm-hmm. watching this motivational thing. Inspiration. Eric Thomas. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you gotta be hungry. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Look for success as much as you want to breathe. Mm-hmm. So I was starting to be conscious mm-hmm. in my things now. The money when it comes in, yeah. I'm no more blowing the money now. Yeah. 
going out, I start to put it aside because now I've got goals, now I've got a mm. vision board, I want to manifest the car, yeah. I want to manifest, so I want to push, now. Yeah. I want to push, yeah. And so mm. you've opened a bank account? Ah, now, I, now I'm, I'm, I'm cruising, You're safely cruising. now, at 19 now. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I read that, yeah, I don't know if yeah, it's true, yeah, I read that you made yeah. your first million at, mm. nine, at, at 19. At 19, that is when my life changed. Okay, yeah. can you tell mm. me how, like, mm. how did mm. you make, what did your first million yeah. comprise of? Was mm. it a series of trades? Yeah. Mm. Um, um, like, what, what exactly comprise of your first million? So, uh, uh, yeah. people, when they think a million is like something that happened like a lottery, one M, uh, mm. it was a, 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 a build up to the million. Now. Mm. Uh -huh. It was a build up to the million. So what I, was, what I did, I was like, let me do something called compound uh, interest. Mm -hmm. you know? And now this is the books I'm reading now, the manifestations I'm mm -hmm. doing. I'm starting to get ideas. Yeah. Oh, let me do compound interest. Yeah. So compound interest is, is basically saying that, okay, Ref, what you've been doing is that you're making $50 per day. Yeah. Okay, why don't you now, don't withdraw the money. Mm -hmm. Do what is called a, 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 a fasting. So you must fast now, a very serious fasting, mm -hmm. a withdrawal fasting. So don't mm -hmm. withdraw anything for the next three, three months mm -hmm. to six months, if mm -hmm. anything. And then I was like to go into monk, monk mode. Uh, don't be anymore. So the thing that is causing people now to spend money to do all these things is remember you want to keep up with the dreams, the jokes mm -hmm. and everything. Mm -hmm. So I was like monk mode now. Mm -hmm. Monk mode now. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, mm -hmm. cancel everything, put the phones aside, mm -hmm. make your money, make mm -hmm. your thing. So I was mm -hmm. like, you know what, I'm going to put myself in meditation. I'm going to start doing manifestation, mm -hmm. consciousness, mm -hmm. and everything. So I was then now doing compound interest. What is compound interest? Yeah, and, and in terms of mm -hmm. cash amount, so 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 yeah. you are mm -hmm. um, putting it into a space where it's going to get compound interest, but yeah. cash amount, yeah. how much money are you act how much money are you putting in? Yeah, so how much now, round are you putting yeah, so in? So now yeah. uh, uh, I'm like, okay, I'm going to put in uh, 500 USD. Mm -hmm. In that 500 USD, mm -hmm. I'm going to make at least 250 USD per week. Okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Calculation in my mind at that yeah. time, I was like, okay, at least uh, let me try to make 10%. Yeah. Yeah. Let me make 10% yeah. uh, per day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's a lot, by the way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a lot. People mm -hmm. are looking for that per year. Yeah. But it's easily achievable, by the way, in Forex trading. Yeah. If you know what you're doing. Yeah. And two trades, three trades, it's even in, uh, more than enough. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, at, I'm trading gold. I'm trading XAUSD, mm -hmm. which is gold. I'm trading GBP USD, I'm trading US, uh, Euro USD. Those are the three things mm -hmm. which I call the, the major pairs and mm -hmm. NZD USD. So, mm -hmm. um, uh, so for, and, and for every five hundred dollars mm -hmm. you're generating, mm -hmm. you're looking to make two hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah, it, it was my it was my plan. So I've mm -hmm. got something on my phone here. I don't mm -hmm. know. I'll show it to you. So mm -hmm. in my phone here is an Excel sheet. Mm -hmm. It's an Excel, Excel sheet, and I wish everyone can get this Excel sheet. Mm -hmm. So in the Excel sheet, you put how much uh, you want to make five hundred USD. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, you put your capital, mm -hmm. 500 USD deposit, mm -hmm. and then you put that, I want to make $100,000, your goal, what mm -hmm. is your goal? Mm -hmm. And then it will show you what you must achieve per day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I was using, so uh, it's a formula. Mm -hmm. I was not just doing something out of my mind. Yes. I was trying to do, I wanted to, to use it as a scientific formula. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I said to myself, when we put 500 USD, uh, I, I won't remember exactly what I was doing, but I know that I wanted to do 10%. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 10%. 10% of what I made, okay. mm -hmm. what I made, yeah, ten percent of what I made, and, you're, and then you're not 10%. taking the money out. Ah, no, no, I don't want to take it. The, if I'm gonna take out the money, because I took out money, sometimes it's when my mom says, "Hey, we need this and that." She was actually disturbing my plan at one time. Eighty percent <laughs> disturbing my goal. Yeah, take out something. Of course, okay, I'll take out something, yeah. but it was not gonna be a, a lot of money. Yeah, mm -hmm. take out something. Take out something. So I'm, I'm, I'm using a scientific for, formula now, because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. people when they approach trading, they are trading with emotions and everything. There's nothing. There's no scientific thing that mm -hmm. they are following. If you can ask them what is your target for the day mm -hmm. they won't tell you mm -hmm. and if they will tell you they will not follow the target mm -hmm. even when they reach the 50 dollars they won't stop they'll mm -hmm. continue and continue mm -hmm. up until they blow the reason people are blowing their money is because of they're not following the target mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so i was following the target following the target so i'm following this book called the turtle trader mm -hmm. which is the book of now traders who are working also at the bank at the working at the hedge fund mm -hmm. these people when i read the book hey these people are dangerous there mm -hmm. there's about four or five guys there uh, uh, they were saying no they were following a system now, a systematic uh, rules, mm -hmm. which means they must have a target, mm -hmm. they must have an exit. You don't open a trade with emotions and exit also with him. So you must open a trade with a logic mm -hmm. and exit with logic. Mm -hmm. Some people open the trade with logic. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a supply now. Let's mm -hmm. say they will exit with emotions mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. So so you must always carry a conscious. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 you know, a uh, view when it mm -hmm. comes to, 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 to trading yeah. at all times. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, that is what I was doing now. So, okay. 500 USD, 10%, 10%. Sometimes I don't reach a 10%. Yeah. Sometimes, let me just show you something. As I'm talking to you, maybe, yeah, yeah. because of now, it's like, I'm just talking. Let me yeah. just... No, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let me just show you, let me show you figure, something I'm, now. Because yeah, I'm, I'm trying to figure you, out, mm, right? Mm -hmm. um, um, let me show you something. My, my account, the real account. account. Yeah. Yeah. I think for the first time ever, 
uh, and this is what I'm, 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 I'm advocating for this, by the way, that people now, they need yeah. to start showing their results. Because yeah. people, everyone today will talk about, I'm doing, I'm doing this, uh, wara, wara, wara. Mm. but when you check, they have nothing to show. <laughs> uh, 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 we've got a lot of experts. Uh, yeah. Well, uh, okay. Uh, this is one of the accounts. Yeah. This is a meta trader. Okay. For is uh, that in that's in 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 uh, uh, this is in Za in Za right yeah in right. Za okay uh, in Za yeah. so uh, in Za oh mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I want you to see something here. Yeah. If you see the power of compound interest, uh, let me see my first deposit. If I can see my first deposit, hey, yo yo now is a lot of deposit here. But anyway, these are withdrawals also there. Okay. But anyway, my first deposit here. Was seventy five thousand za. Yeah, seventy thousand. Yeah. With this deposit, I went all the way to this amount. This profit, you that's, see that. That's one million. Profit. One million. Yeah. yeah. I wanted to check the date here. My deposit was when, twenty twenty three or one thirty. Yeah. Uh, let's check. Uh, now, when was my last trading? Okay. You will see the losses. The losses are gonna be there. Yeah. But I want you to see how many months I took these things. Actually, about three months that yeah. I went to that thing. Mm. Compound interest. It's just that, of course. Yeah, compound interest, you will see. Yeah. yeah. There's never a point where I, I started to withdraw, I mean, uh, deposit money that is. Yeah, because I've seen, I've seen yeah. the 75,000 mm. initial deposit. Uh, there's the, never a point where. The, uh, yeah. A million, shil a million in, in profit and 800,000. Yeah, a million in, za. And 800,000. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. basically, 75,000 rent, that yeah. is my idea. Yeah. I'm going to get a 100% bonus. Yeah. Uh -huh. So what I do with this 100% bonus. Yeah. I'm going to do what, because now 100% bonus, by the way, it's a, it's, it, can, it can also, hey, this thing of 100% bonus, yeah. it can hit you very hard because you're excited, you see a lot of yeah. money. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. But me, with 100% bonus, it gives me an opportunity to open higher lots, yeah. but also at very strategic uh, points. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, with that 100%, so 75,000 rand, I'll make a double of that, yeah. which is 150. From there, I'm going to withdraw it. Yeah. I don't take it to the bank. I just withdraw it to the platform and then, Deposit again to get 100% yeah. bonus. Yeah. You see, so 300 key. Mm. We throw it. It's just okay. like that. Yeah. So in okay. that way, I'm, I'm, I'm using leverage using. to my advantage. Yeah. Okay. So and so this was the same formula you're using at, the, using at, at that, that initial yeah, point. Yeah, so how, how many yeah. months did it take you? Now with this $500, mm. how yeah. many months did it take you to generate? In that way, it took me long. Million. Now I can do it faster now. Yes. <laughs> yeah, now I can do it faster. Because now we're yeah. we Dr. Refuge Amman. Remember yeah. now, I'm a doctor now. Yeah. I'm a Kung Fu master. I'm a grandmaster. Yeah, now, but now it's faster. But normally it takes you. How long did it take you? You yeah. can even go to MetaTrader 5. That is one of my accounts. You can go to MetaTrader 5. Mm -hmm. If you get a chance, you'll see another account now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Demonstration of power. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so uh, it took me uh, six, six to nine months. Uh, uh, yeah. So the million rand, really, uh, the million, I, I, I found myself a millionaire. Mm -hmm. I don't remember when I became the millionaire, but I knew I'm a millionaire. Yeah. 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 So I, I used to withdraw. I, I withdraw. I bought a BMW mm -hmm. uh, 320. Mm -hmm. I withdraw. I bought a, a Mercedes Benz C180. Mm -hmm. Uh, 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 so I uh, yeah so the so it's, it's it's as if the more you draw the more you mm. attack somehow this thing just works uh, mm. uh, yeah 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 uh, the more you draw uh, the more you buy something for yourself and make yourself happy you mm. just buy this shirt mm -hmm. for five hundred dollars it's the more you make more money it just becomes a domino effect mm -hmm. yeah so you must pay did you effect. did you yeah. did you increase the number of investments that you were making um at the time when you started making yeah. money. So honestly speaking, I never really invested in anything besides Forex. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. The only time I would invest in something, it's when maybe uh, I'm buying, because I have books, if you can check my books. Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, mm. Woo, I've, got a, I've got a library. Mm. Yeah, so I, 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 and indeed one day I want to open a library mm. uh, for others. So mm -hmm. I, I, I buy a lot of books and mm -hmm. I, I spend a lot of money in courses, mm -hmm. buying courses. So even when I'm doing well as a trader, mm -hmm. when I see someone, oh, there's someone called Tim Sykes. I'm gonna buy his course. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, or there's someone called Greg Sek. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna buy his course. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's someone called uh, there's another guy also who's very uh, Anton Crail. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna buy his course. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's someone called Paul Tudor Jones. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna buy. It. So uh, anyone that I see that is popping up is doing well. But it was an investment primarily mm -hmm. in your craft and in yeah, what in, in what craft. in what you were doing. Yeah, in what but I'm you doing. never you mm -hmm. never you never like bought a bar or uh, like honest, uh, 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 buy anything uh, uh, else. It's too. only now, funny, funny speaking, mm -hmm. only now two years three years ago, mm -hmm. I started to now look into other stuff. Mm -hmm. But I've I've been always just focusing on forex mm -hmm. because i felt like hey i think i tried to invest in something and i, I bent my hands there there was a scheme mm -hmm. that i invested in and i was mm -hmm. like you know triple m you know these things of uh, this scheme where you put money and the money comes hey, uh, you know the schemes i don't know if you know the schemes <laughs> yeah but uh, you put some money yeah. after some time to go mm. yeah yeah but uh, hey, the money market fund uh, yeah money market i don't know what is happening but whatever yeah. it is hey, it bent my hands yeah it's like you see this kind of thing say hey, mm. yeah because i'm a risk taker but i was like you know let me just focus on something that I mm -hmm. have control of. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. When it comes to investment, you must always try to 
in the beginning, focus on something that you have a control of yeah. up until you can really now put in, in other someone's cause. Now, remember now, the minute you give someone your money mm-hmm. or something out there, it's, you know, it's just you, you are hoping yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. So after you make your first, your first mm-hmm. million, right? Mm-hmm. How, um, um, what's the journey between now one million to a hundred million? Mm-hmm. How long does it take you to get to the hundred ah, million? Now, now? You, 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 you'll be so shocked. That is why they say the more money you've got in trading mm-hmm. is the better. The mm-hmm. rich get richer. They mm-hmm. are really telling the truth. The rich mm-hmm. get richer when it comes mm-hmm. to trading. Because now when you have money, I don't know how it works. Uh, uh, but I also understand it deeper there as a philosopher mm-hmm. uh, that somehow money attracts money. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even when you're supposed to lose, you just win on that day somehow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the loss becomes mm-hmm. a win. So mm-hmm. uh, how I, I grew now, how I grew astronomically now, mm-hmm. it's now when I start to open uh, my company called Forex AMG. Mm-hmm. Uh, called and Forex actually, AMG. one more question. Yeah. At this point, when you're yeah. earning your first million, because now mm-hmm. you're 19, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. are you now on your own name? You're no longer on your mom's. I'm now on my, uh, my own no name. On your mom's. Yeah. Oh, Okay, all right. Uh, and then for her, I, I funded some small money for her. Okay. Uh, which I call now a small man, $1,000 uh, for her now. Mm-hmm. Ah, just she goes, ah, well, I'll do something. Hey, but the woman, yeah. a very scared, emotional trader. Yeah. She will make something, something about like, You know, I'm going to trade that money also for her now, this whole yeah. household. Yeah. Uh, because I started to move out now yeah. from home. Ah, uh, and when, as you move out, yeah. what are then your expenses? Yeah, yeah now moving out now, mm-hmm. I'm going to uh, Sangara now. <laughs> yeah, I'm going, to, I'm going to the, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, I, 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 initially, I went to stay in a hotel. The first thing I went to <laughs> stay in a hotel. So <laughs> you are living in a hotel. Yeah, in a hotel. How uh, much was, in, how much was uh, that? The name of the hotel is Michael Angel Hotel. Mm. Michael Angel mm, Hotel. Yeah. Okay. So per night in that hotel is like $200. Mm. Okay. Yeah. How, long, how long did you mm. live in the hotel? Uh, yo, I stayed three months in the hotel. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah, you spent $200 yeah. for... Yeah. Um, is that all inclusive in terms of all the three meals? Uh, no, no, no. Oh. A meal is something else. Actually. That's bed. Yeah, that's yeah, bed. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, yeah, that's just, just yeah. Bed I know it includes breakfast though, yeah. but the meals like other stuff. Ah, mm. and the hotel food is really not nice, man. Mm. So I went. <laughs> <laughs> so I was going out, you know. So you're spending six thousand dollars. Yeah, 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 On your accommodation yeah, 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 at the of time, money, yeah, because of I just bought a car. Mm-hmm. I've got two cars. So now I'm now becoming this uh, social media, you uh, 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 know, a uh, person. Now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm starting to be known on social media. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I've got these cars. I'm what what the, year is this? Mm, yeah, this oh, 2014. Yeah, 2014. Yeah, my, my, my shot to start home. Yeah. Yeah, it was in 2014. 20, 2014. 2014 yeah, okay. But see, 2016, I was a hot, 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 hot. <laughs> ah, then, no, 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 no. They are untouchable now. It, when, <laughs> I, when I move now, it's <laughs> like, hey, it's apostolic. You see, when I move, move a lot of people entourage. <laughs> <laughs> and are you keeping are you keeping track of your exp- of, of of your expenditure and I'm your money or who is keeping anything. track? Now. Now, yeah, yeah, now so I'm you just know that money is coming in. Money is coming in, and you're, uh, and, and you're money, spending I've it. I've got this new mantra called uh, 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 the motto called uh, "Money must flow in abundance." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> it must go out as soon as it comes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yo, 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 yo. I was very flamboyant. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So when you talk so about in fact, you talk about flamboyance mm. because before before we we, mm. we 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 started the the podcast, we're here with mm. your brother, and you said that you had more than eighteen. Um, cars. Yes, can yes. we go through that list? Yeah. yeah, can we go through uh, that list? Uh, uh, so, yo, I wouldn't even yeah. remember. I was including people that I bought for cars, but a uh, Range Rover, mm-hmm. uh, a Range Rover. Okay, let me check because it's there. Yeah. Anyway, sometimes I don't like to talk anymore, man. I like to show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that telling me business, it's show me yeah. business. Yeah. yeah. Uh, let me just check, actually. Uh, but it's a lot. Uh, yo, I don't want to lie to you. Um, uh, uh, if you can go through my Instagram, you'll see that hey, this guy is a, is a, is a problem. Mm. Uh, and this young man is a problem. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, this young man, Mm-mm. this young man is a problem. This is some of the. Uh, this is now the Aston Martin. Okay. Yeah, the Aston Martin. Uh, this is now the BMW. This is the first car. Just the first about. Yeah. Uh-huh. I also had another one. Uh, uh, he's an, yeah, 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 yeah. I was just showing off <laughs> there. Uh, then I bought uh, bought for my uh, my cousin. I so I was the opera of the family. Everyone in the family, mm-hmm. I was buying them cars mm-hmm. now. Yeah. Uh, this is one of another one, the M4, yeah. uh, BMW M4. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, Refway. As you can see, I used to write on the side. Refway, yes. Yeah, <laughs> I, I used to write. I used to write on Tell the me your most, your most, mm-hmm. your most, um, mm-hmm. I guess, expensive purchase. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the most expensive one, let me see. Uh, even if it's not a card, most expensive oh, oh, purchase. Oh, yeah, no, no, it's a house. It's a house. It's a house yeah, yeah, no, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, it's a house, yeah. I went, yeah, I went deeper on the house. Mm-hmm. Uh, the house was uh, one million dollars. Mm-hmm. Uh, one million dollars. Yeah, one million dollars. Yeah. One beer uh, Bentley. Yo, I forgot the Bentley. Yo, yeah, yeah. I even forgot this. Bentley is there. Uh, there's a Bentley. Uh, yeah, yo, yo, yeah. You know what? It's a st- yes, you can see what is this one here. Hey. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Yeah. 
Right. Hey, just show them the hey. Hey, hey, R-R. Yeah. yeah, so watch this space. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I'm a problem. I don't yeah. want to lie to you. I have yeah. a very serious problem. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a very serious problem. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so your house, so, your, your house is, a, is, is a million. Yeah, it's a million dollars. It's a million dollars. Yeah, yeah, How much dollars. is that in, mm-hmm. in, 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 in rand? Uh, now, uh, it was now in rands. Now, on today's, yeah. it's 20 million rand, 19 million rand. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But at the time, it was 16 million rand. Okay. Yeah, 16. So it's a million dollars. And you know how they go, it will go up. Someone yeah. was even telling me that it's even 21 million now. Right now. Yeah, 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 yeah rent. So yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. The house, I went there. Uh, I actually had even a bigger one. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Because of there was a, a, a in my journey of, 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 of going up, mm-hmm. there was also a downfall and also a rise again. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So what, 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 what happened head. in the downfall? What, com- what, what that is why I say head. So now, yeah. Uh, me being the ambitious me, mm-hmm. uh, okay, I'm a forest trader, I'm doing well, I've mm-hmm. got, I'm doing well, I'm just doing well. For a young guy, uh, yeah. jealous down, I'm doing well. Yeah. So at the age of 20 years old, mm-hmm. you know, uh-huh, I then uh, 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 heard about, um, I don't know if you've heard about Satoshi Nakamoto. Mm. No, I Satoshi have. Nakamoto is supposed to be the, uh, the founder of, 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 of Bitcoin. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So I started to put my hands in, 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 in cryptocurrencies. Mm-hmm. Yeah. In cryptocurrencies. I've been hearing about eCash for some time, mm-hmm. but then I started to delve deeper into cryptocurrencies. Mm-hmm. Cryptocurrencies. So then I then went into the journey of opening my own cryptocurrency. Mm-hmm. So in the cryptocurrency journey now, uh, my vision was very simple. I, 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 I'm already the first trader. I'm well known. Mm-hmm. Let me use this fame and everything also to push a cryptocurrency. Mm-hmm. Because I thought the cryptocurrency is very simple. Mm-hmm. You just start up your, your own coin, you list it on what is called the coin market cap, mm-hmm. and then from there, you tell people about it, and then it goes up in value, and just as simple as that. Mm-hmm. That's what I thought, and that's not what happened. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's not what happened, mm-hmm. you see. So uh, 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 so some people took it pe- very personal, but just to fast forward, because it's a long story, mm-hmm. just to fast forward, I started my own cryptocurrency. Mm-hmm. And then that is where... Uh, 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 Good things happen and bad things happen. The mm-hmm. good thing happened is that now it grew me very popular mm-hmm. because it was Africa's first cryptocurrency. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then as it's Africa's first cryptocurrency, it then made me an enemy of the financial system. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because of now uh, they've got the stand big bank, we've got these banks and everything. Mm-hmm. They're not excited mm-hmm. about that, that thing. Yeah. And then unlike Satoshi Nakamoto, who's a faceless character, mm-hmm. I, was a, I was a, you could see me, who's the owner of this thing? Mm-hmm. Why is everyone withdrawing money? What are they investing in? What's going mm-hmm. on? Mm-hmm. So then I became the target now of mm-hmm. the Reserve Bank. Mm-hmm. I became the target now. Mm-hmm. Uh, so uh, in people's minds, they think me, I just woke up one morning and then I, I closed this cryptocurrency. Yeah, because pe- people, people lost yeah, money. Yeah, right? yeah, so people, they think me, I just mm-hmm. woke up. Okay, you know what? Uh, these people are mad. Let me just uh, disappear because other people have been saying I ran away mm-hmm. or whatever. Nothing like that happened. How, much, how, how much money was in the crypto um, kind? Uh, I mean, how, much, how much did people, all the people that invested, over, how much did they over. People don't, don't even know. Mm-hmm. Someone was even saying it was 200 million mm-hmm. and I was laughing to say, you know what, some people are just taking chances. As a matter of fact, it was uh, uh, over a billion. Uh, people don't know that. Uh, 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 when I said, was, yes, mm. uh, I was actually one point, I said to people that I'm the youngest billionaire. Mm-hmm. And I did not only say that uh, uh, I was actually proven to be one mm-hmm. at one stage in Africa. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, uh, because of the evaluation of the company. Mm-hmm. So the cryptocurrency turned over, mm-hmm. monthly turned over. It mm-hmm. was over a billion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, you understand now that I was, I was really pushing, I was pushing, I was pushing, yeah. I was pushing. Uh, but however, uh, I don't want to lie to you, things didn't go the way that they were supposed to go. Yeah, what happened? What, yeah. what, what, what so led to the collapse? I, yeah. I, so, so the collapse uh, was a lot of things, mm-hmm. was a lot of, lot of things. Mm-hmm. However, the major, 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 major thing, mm-hmm. it, is, uh, it is now me uh, being approached by... Uh, this is one of the, I was just talking to the CEO, talking about Capital Markets Authority. Is it the mm-hmm. one that... Yeah, yeah that's here. Of yeah. South Africa now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Of South Africa. Mm-hmm. To say, hey, man... What you're doing mm-hmm. is not legal. Mm-hmm. How? It's not legal. Why is it not legal? Because you don't have a license for it. Mm-hmm. But the, my, then my question uh, with my lawyers at the time was, what is the license for cryptocurrency mm-hmm. then? So that we can get it. We mm-hmm. want to get it then. Mm-hmm. Uh, but they were saying, no, we're still busy with the licenses. But for now, mm-hmm. you need to cease operations. Mm-hmm. So uh, in the beginning, I continued because now to cease operations, you can't just wake up and tell people that, hey, guys, we have to close now. Hey, I continued, I continued. Mm-hmm. Then they, they, they were left with no choice to come to my offices. Mm-hmm. 
So they, they did what is called a raid. You know a raid? Yes. FBI, open up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they did a raid. Yeah. And yeah. that's what people don't see. Mm-hmm. People don't, don't, don't see that part. And there's nothing I shared also on the internet. Because mm-hmm. remember, we also got people who are haters. Mm-hmm. Who will be excited? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I said, this is my personal journey. Mm-hmm. I will just explain, guys, things didn't go. We will come back. We'll bounce back. But for yeah. now. Yeah. So uh, and so then I had a truth. So when they came, they took the computers, the servers. Yeah. So that was a big thing now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. As a matter of fact, uh, at one point, they were even telling me that I'm very fortunate because of really I was not doing something that is too illegal where now I'm <laughs> running away. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where it's yeah. also not even illegal, by the way. It is a perception, remember? Yeah, yeah it is a perception. The, the license wasn't, wasn't Yeah, yeah, you created, see, yeah, it was not yeah. there. But me, I'm not ever planning to... I always tell people who say, no, Ref Wayne was planning this or Ref Wayne is a scammer or whatever. I also say to people, how is it possible that someone... Uh, uh, okay, I don't know. Maybe scammers will work. Uh, they work mm. very different. Maybe the question around the uh, yeah, pot- yeah, yeah, scamming yeah. or potential yeah, scamming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What happens to the money? Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm coming to that. Yeah. So uh, maybe people uh, the scam they don't understand what is a scam mm. uh, because a scam. One thing I know with scammers, and I said I used to at, 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 at a young age, I used to be obsessed with watching documentaries. Yeah, and, yeah. yeah. A scam, it is someone who's sitting down with a syndicate. It's a group of us <laughs> like this. Yeah, it's a syndicate who say, man, we're going to this. Kenya, we are going there and it's going to be... Yeah, we are gonna, yeah. we're going to take the most money. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we're going to vanish. Yeah. But wh- what kind of a scammer is this one who's still with us, doing podcasts, is around, he's still with the people there, he's mm. still doing seminars. Mm. It's not a scam. And then uh, even myself, they saw that all those cars that I had, that the two cars... Have, have you watched, they were, they have you watched um, <laughs> um, Tinder Swindler? Uh, no, 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 no. On <laughs> on uh, on Netflix. I mean, it's a guy who was, was, was scamming people, taking for money. But yeah. I guess he was there. He never, he mm. never really, um, yeah. uh, you know, like wasn't there. But yeah, anyway, yeah. Yeah, other, yeah. anyway, those ones can survive in South Africa. <laughs> don't try that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't try that. That's a scam. Yeah. Yo, you need to get out. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Get, mm. They'll finish you. Yeah, okay. So, 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 so what happened? Yeah. Someone, so, so people who don't understand the system. Mm. They think that, uh, and I think I uh, blame myself for, for not doing education, mm-hmm. a lot of education on mm-hmm. that. People don't understand how cryptocurrency works. Mm-hmm. And really, because I was, a, I was a pioneer and I was one of the first people, in their mind, mm-hmm. it's a central system. Mm-hmm. Cryptocurrency does not work. Like, go to Bitcoin right now. I've got some Bitcoins that I'm buying and selling mm-hmm. now to make a profit. Mm-hmm. When I buy Bitcoin right now on a, on a, on a platform here mm-hmm. uh, called, uh, what is this one, Coinbase, mm-hmm. The minute I say I want to buy cryptocurrency there, mm-hmm. there's something that is called P2P trading, mm-hmm. peer-to-peer. Mm-hmm. When I buy, I'm not buying and putting money in his account. Mm-hmm. I'm putting money, which is he's the owner of Coinbase. Mm-hmm. I'm, he's an exchange. He's a middleman mm-hmm. who's going to make some, some transactions mm-hmm. fees. You see. Mm-hmm. I'm going to put money in your account, the seller of those coins. Mm-hmm. So when people say now... Uh, 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 they think it's a central money. It's, a, it's called a decentralized system. Mm-hmm. Whereas, uh, that, uh, and then to prove that is that now, me, if I would have money coming to my account, that mm-hmm. is where the, the scam begins now. Because mm-hmm. that is where uh, my, uh, my lawyers were arguing that that is where you need a license. Mm-hmm. If I'm operating uh, as to take in deposits of people, mm-hmm. then you are a bank. Mm-hmm. Then you need, of course, now it's a But this is just, faci- you but are facilitating yeah, I'm, yeah, transactions. I'm yo, yo, if, if people just can understand that part, that the refrain was not the person who's taking money. Hey, the refrain is connecting you with people, buyers and sellers. Mm-hmm. And in the lack of buyers, mm-hmm. in the lack of demand, mm-hmm. it, 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 it's, it's a logical uh, economics 101. Mm-hmm. Where there's a lack of demand, uh, based on maybe this panic, based on, hey, there was a raid at the offices, hey, there was what, da, 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 and people don't want to buy, they just want to sell. Mm-hmm. Indeed, there's going to be a drop of, 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 of price, mm-hmm. you see. Mm-hmm. So uh, if Bitcoin right now comes from, like right now, Bitcoin is, let's say, $30,000. Mm-hmm. Tomorrow, I say, hey, man, let's go buy Bitcoin. You buy the $30,000. Tomorrow, it's $1,000. Can you call it a scam? It's not really a scam. It's just that now the, uh, the price your, of Your, your is product down. is worth so, yeah, less than what so, you yes, bought it so, for. So I don't want to lie. Uh, eventually, with all the saga, mm. uh, I was then in the middle of that. So, so that's a regrettable thing. So now people now, they, there were some who did not understand, but at least 80% understood that, no, this guy, anyway, when you make a payment, whether it's MBS or whatever, mm-hmm. there's no way where we made a payment to his name. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was making... So those who understand, understand. But other people say, hey, even though we didn't pay you, but because you are the one who... Mm-hmm. who, asked, you, who yeah, we, they want to deal with you physically. Mm-hmm. So, but and then, you know, I then had to do a lot of uh, uh, media press releases to say, mm-hmm. 
I'm not the guy who did this thing. Mm. Fight with your government who stopped this thing. That's mm. not a fact. And then now, look, funny enough, now, ironically, today, the same government, uh, the same institution who was uh, against cryptocurrencies mm -hmm. 10 years ago, today, now, I saw them in, in, in the papers just few, th uh, two years ago. They are now busy with uh, uh, cryptocurrency, digital uh, currency. There's, they are now doing some countries right now around mm. the world. They are doing their own digital currencies. Mm. So you see, uh, I was ahead of time. And normally in America, that is why I, I love America. And sometimes I wish that I was really born in America. <laughs> uh, because in America, they were not going to shut me down. What was going to happen is that they were going to say, hey, man, what you're doing is wrong or something wrong How, or whatever, whatever. However, let us bring in our experts mm. who will help you to, be, to make that thing if, it's, if you don't have a license, okay, help me with a license. Like, they will help you somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so all the geniuses of, um, in America, when you look at them, uh, even the one of Facebook, the founder, Mark Zuckerberg, you mm -hmm. go to Edwards, you go to Sean Parker, mm -hmm. you, you look at all these people, what they were doing in the beginning was deemed to be illegal, mm -hmm. but somehow it became legal mm -hmm. in the process. Why? It's because of now, uh, even the Congress, when they were shouting at them and everything, they were given experts mm. who helped them, yeah. blockchain experts, whoever, to yeah. help. So this boy is doing something good. Yeah. For his age, 20 years old, 21, yeah. let's help him. Yeah. So I was very angry that I didn't get that support. And mm. even people themselves to say, hey man, no man, this guy cannot be a scammer. What can we do to help you yeah. to make this thing work? Yeah. So they were happy now that, that, that there was a collapse of something like that. Yeah. Of which today when I look at it, it was going to be very, very, very far. Yeah. You would probably be knowing about it today. If, the if way it was still there. there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. I want to ask you a question. Um, and, you know, I'm going to wrap up maybe in like the next 10 minutes. But I'll ask you a question around mindset. I'm mm -hmm. um, knowing that, I guess you grew up in, in, in sort of less privileged spaces mm -hmm. and money meant something mm -hmm. for you. How do you move to a place where you spend, you know, so much opulence and mm -hmm. just abundance? How, how was it? What, what, did you never ever feel like? because of the background that you'd come from, mm -hmm. that I need to keep this money, mm -hmm. you know? I could lose money at any point in time, therefore I need to keep it. Mm -hmm. um, is that not a, f a feeling or a thought that came, came uh, across to you at all? For me, those feelings, when I thought about them, yeah. I used to brush them away. Because <laughs> in my mind, it's a negative spirit. <laughs> that wants to stop me from enjoying, my enjoyment, my enjoyment. I want yeah. to enjoy. Mm. Yeah. So, uh, 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 but la later now, with this age now, of course you become more... Age, some age plays a big role, you know. Okay. Yeah, when you are young, you don't really think about that. You blow the money. That is why a lot of people right now will tell you that they, they used to have money, but today they're at zero. Yeah. So uh, I was very fortunate to have people now who guided me, like, to yeah. say, man, why don't you even buy a house? Imagine I'm staying in a hotel. Yeah. The same money, at least even if I can rather rent a house or something. Yeah. yeah, so I was not thinking about those things. In my mind, I was money must come in and it must... It, it used to be itchy. I yeah. feel like money must it's, not be in the bank. Burning a hole it, in yeah, your pocket. Yeah, I used to go. Yes. Hey, where, where, where is it popping in Kenya? <laughs> yeah, you see, I, now I, I was not even going to come to this podcast. Yeah. It's a waste of time. For me. Oh, no, I need to dance. Mm. Mm. So, <laughs> I, I don't want podcast. No, 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 no. I need to dance urgently. Yeah. Money must go away fast. Uh, yeah. mm. And it's a property mentality that one that we have in Africa. <laughs> it must be fixed by the yeah. way. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Fixed. Yeah. So, so, so you, so. And right now, mm -hmm. if we were to sort of look at where you're right now, do you have any other investments, or mm -hmm. do you, or have you kept the same um, mm -hmm. philosophy of forex is mm -hmm. where you're trading, forex is where you're investing, yeah. mm -hmm. and that's the only thing that matters? No, now, uh, 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 yo, yeah, now with what I've seen in the past and mm -hmm. how money, I saw that money can be here and go away. Yeah, yeah, I, I then started to invest now in. Uh, uh, what, I, what I call brick and mortar businesses, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, uh, tangible things. So yeah. uh, I do have uh, some things. I will not mention the name though, yeah. but it's a establishment mm -hmm. where you can buy uh, something nice. So, mm -hmm. so the first thing someone said to me, because uh, I was asking this other guy, he's a billionaire, and asking him, hey, "I want to invest in something. What can I invest in?" He said, "In right now, t list ten things that you like." I said, mm -hmm. huh? "Me, yeah, list ten things that you like." I said, "He said invest in something that you love doing." Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And then. You, you probably find people. So, mm -hmm. so I like going out, having fun. So have an establishment, uh, even if it's not a nightclub, but a restaurant, have something like that. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, uh, what, 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 what thing do you like again? So no, uh, of course, I wanted to have my own uh, brokerage at one day. So mm -hmm. start doing your license, start learning about, mm -hmm. you know, yeah, doing exams. Mm -hmm. you see? So one day I want to see myself having my own firm. Mm -hmm. That is one of the, the visions, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, so you want to be at those levels. Mm -hmm. Even a bank, why not? Mm -hmm. If you can, you know, so I really want to put in there. So, so far I've invested in, in those kind of things, yeah. Mm -hmm. Small stuff, small mm -hmm. stuff, but at least 
uh, I can sell them tomorrow. If, yeah. You know. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Maybe another question is: all the money that you have. So, for mm -hmm. example, even what you've just shown us mm -hmm. right now, is all of that your own money? If the truth of the matter now, as you go higher in the ladder of financial, uh, people uh, people don't know that there's a certain level where you don't own hundred percent of something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You own ten percent of a billion. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So people would rather have hundred percent of. Nothing. Mm -hmm. uh, so me right now, even this establishment I'm talking about, probably I have fifteen percent there. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, there's something called what? What? Oh, I'm gonna have ten percent. Oh, there's gonna oh this this podcast can I have five percent there? So mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. So now uh, everything that I own is a part. I'm a part owner of something like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have what is called the asset management group. Mm -hmm. uh, so in the asset management group, we've got now at least that one. We've got a license for it where. Uh, people can come in, although uh, we're going to have the proper license where we can even accept deposits. Mm -hmm. But for now, you just uh, put money in one account and then we call it the pool account, then we trade it there. Mm -hmm. You see, uh, so mm -hmm. yeah, so yeah, yeah, that is what we are doing. So, this is one of the performance accounts mm -hmm. actually of that account mm -hmm. yeah, that I'm showing you. Ah, yeah. uh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. okay, mm -hmm. all right. Mm -hmm. Um, I guess as we as we um as we sort of close, I mean, mm -hmm. any any maybe maybe actually before I ask my last mm -hmm. question. In this period of, of privilege and everything, you know, mm -hmm. um, um, going really well, what's been the lowest point? Mm -hmm. um, um, let's talk a little bit about maybe the, the effect that money has on your um, emotional, psychological consciousness mm -hmm. and your ability to pursue happiness, you mm -hmm. know? I guess um, people say money isn't everything, mm. but people, say, in fact, the person who was a person who we've had on the podcast who said, but broke people are the ones who say that. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so my question is, 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 is that the case? Mm. Um, um, have you experienced um, lots of unhappiness or mm. possibly mm. even depression or, <laughs> or depressed moments, mm. um, even in your abundance mm. and, and your privilege? Yeah. Uh, in the beginning, uh, and then I'll tell you a story of Michael Jackson. Mm -hmm. In the beginning, I don't want to lie to you. Every single thing that I wanted to do mm -hmm. in the beginning, and that is why I became well known like this and everything. Mm -hmm. My number one ambition was to make a lot of money, millions and millions and millions, and party and go around the world and splash it and just champagne mm -hmm. and everything and be well known. Mm -hmm. And then, but in the journey of in that thing, I started to realize that oh, that is why they say Michael Jackson died a bit de 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 depressed man. Mm -hmm. It's because of now there's a certain level where now you don't find fulfillment in that. Mm -hmm. You are like, but is it really what I was born for? Mm -hmm. uh, to just go out and you know, pour mm -hmm. everything. What is really the purpose? Uh, so uh, Michael Jackson, uh, because was one, one of the most, most well-known people, mm -hmm. it was said that he was so sad that he can't even go to a shop to buy himself something. Because mm -hmm. the minute he enters at the parking lot, they hear Michael Jackson, there's a lot of people around, so he couldn't even live his life anymore. Mm -hmm. So he lost himself and gain the wealth, mm -hmm. you see. So I started to see that pattern with my life that what is, why, why does it look like I'm starting to lose myself here and gaining everything? I've got this cars and everything, but why am I even changing my language? Because mm -hmm. yeah, you start to change your own philosophy. Because my mm -hmm. philosophy is, is my original philosophy as a refrain, mm -hmm. as I was born. Mm -hmm. I'm a philanthropist. I'm there for the people. Uh, I'm someone who wants to go to schools and do mm -hmm. motivational speaking, mm -hmm. help the kids, you know, donate and everything. But now it's as if now it's becoming egotistic. It's becoming now self-centered. Mm -hmm. So the lowest point was that, you know what, in order to survive depression, because mm -hmm. I could see that depression is going to come. Mm -hmm. uh, or even drugs. Some people even start doing drugs. I said, mm -hmm. let me open a foundation. And I started opening a foundation called Refoin Foundation. Mm -hmm. That is where I found my home there. Mm -hmm. And then starting to use this money now. Instead of buying the cars, last just two weeks ago, mm -hmm. uh, I made money in the market. And I was asking my brother, yet, what must I do? Is uh, And uh, he was telling me that, no, buy a BM, buy this latest mm -hmm. one. I said, for, for the first time ever, he had me saying something different. I said, that $100,000 that I would use for this, let me take 30 schools and, and give them $5,000. Let me, let me donate. Let me. So the language is different now. It is mm -hmm. more on how can I impact society. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, so that tomorrow now, Someone said, by this young man, even people who are angry, yeah, someone who said, no, he, hey, he's a scammer, but he's a scammer who's doing good things. <laughs> no, he's a good scammer. <laughs> yeah, if he's a but scammer, tell me, no, but I, I, but I, I want you yeah, to, yeah, yeah, yeah. to give me a practical mm -hmm. example yeah. of a low moment that mm -hmm. you have experienced. No, no, no. I, me, I was so fortunate mm -hmm. uh, that every low moment, I, I could see it coming. Mm. So I never ever reached it and sat there. Mm. Besides the one where the crypto fell down and yeah. everyone was calling me names, that was the lowest moment. You see that one? 
I always tell people if I survive that part, mm. aye, 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 aye. because there, yo, I was even scared to go out because in your mind you think you are going out, the, the first thing people are going to hold you. Yeah, but it, honestly speaking, instead when I went out, people were encouraging me. And what, yeah. but even mm. then, even mm. when you're in the low moment and afraid of going out, mm. what's going through your head at that point? Like, what are you thinking? What are you fear. telling yourself? Yo, fear is a lot of fear mm -hmm. and a lot of regret mm -hmm. and a lot of, you know, uh, uh, just this taste in the mouth, I didn't have a good taste in the mouth. Mm. It's like, wow, what's going on now? How did mm. I end up here? Mm. You see, it started off so nicely. Why, yeah. why, why? You yeah. see, so you, know, you regret so many things, you know, that ish, really, 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 and your biggest wish is that people can really see that, that good side of you that yeah. is not what you think. Yeah. Hey, but hey, you know that there's going to be those haters who are waiting for that moment now. Yeah. That is why you must never share your lowest moments with the public. Yeah. Uh, just always be happy because of the people who, if they see the lowest moment, they're yeah. going to capitalize on the lowest yeah. moment. And that is when you're going to go to depression. Yeah. So uh, in other ways, never ever share. Share to one or two people that mm. you are sad, you are mm. going through something, but mm. never ever share it publicly. Because mm. the minute you share it publicly to everyone, guys, I'm going through something, you will be so shocked that those people are going to mock you and they will lead you to depression. Yeah. So I was so shocked. I said, you know what? I'm going to heal quickly. Yeah. And, and bounce back, and I did bounce back. So you won't even realize when I had mm. a problem. Yeah. Mm. As far as people are concerned, I've just been popular. Just been fine. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Last question. Yeah. How much has luck mm. played a role mm. in you achieving um, the success that you mm. have? Yeah. Uh, well, as someone, some, many people, millionaires and billionaires, they say, no, there's nothing like luck and everything. I really believe there is luck mm. and there is, uh, the luck is there, but mm. I don't believe it's just luck that is lucky also. Mm. I believe that you can consciously and deliberately create luck in mm -hmm. your life. And mm -hmm. how do you consciously de deliberate? That is what I teach about uh, having a quiet time. Because now I started to learn every millionaire or billionaire that I've met, actually even millionaires, I see them. Because millionaires, mm -hmm. I feel like some millionaires are even just liking them. But billionaires are people who are deliberately there by, hey, yeah, 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 yeah. There's a certain level of life that uh, uh, you, you need to consciously be aware of things mm -hmm. around. So when I look at the billionaires, they are always conscious about their energy, who they are with, number one. They are always conscious about what they say, the, what they say in their mouth. Mm -hmm. They are always speaking positive about things. So uh, uh, luck, then you create it yourself by saying, I'm going to make it, it's gonna, I'm going to come out, I'm going to... So luck, you generate it. You generate mm -hmm. the luck with what you say. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Your optimism, mm -hmm. uh, your, your environment where you are, you must always be in a very good environment yeah. so you can generate... So even luck, when it comes, it can find you very ready and prepared. Yeah, yeah so luck really played a big role, but I know that let luck, it was not a coincidence. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And luck... It goes in different ways. Other people who are religious will call it a, an anointing. Other people will call it a blessing. Other people will call it you. So, but I know, me, I call it a blessing. Mm. I don't call it luck. I know mm. it's a blessing because there are some situations. And how do you spot luck or a blessing? Mm. It is when you are in a position where you know consciously that mm. here you are out. Mm. There's no way out. Mm. And then you find yourself coming back. Mm. Then you know that you are a blessed man. So really, uh, I cannot call it luck. If I can call it luck, I'll really be, uh, um, you know, uh, th uh, th yeah, yeah, I will be condescending and really downgrading mm. this blessing that I was given. So it is a blessing. Uh, and I believe that with conscious prayer and everything, you can find yourself blessed. And everyone needs to be blessed. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Favor. Um, parting shot, last thing that you want to say? Yeah. Last thing that you want to say, possibly uh, the viewers, the last thing I want to say, uh, last thing I want to say uh, is now, uh, I talk about the nine Ps, the, the, the miracle of the nine Ps. Mm -hmm. Poor people can progress from poverty, mm -hmm. provided that they are prepared to pay the price for prosperity. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, those are the nine Ps. <laughs> so uh, any person in the world who wants to become successful mm -hmm. can become successful, but you, you need to be willing to pay the price. Mm -hmm. And what is the price? I said that price does not even need to be money. Price can be time. Price can be energy. But you need to put some effort into what you want to do. Mm -hmm. So right now I'm in Kenya. Uh, there's a seminar that I'm being invited to. Uh, uh, I'm here. I'm going to be having fun. I just want to say to people watching this video who are in Kenya or Uganda, anywhere, uh, 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 who want to know more. Guys, I'm here. It's my first time coming here. If you really want to see Dr. Refoin coming back, please let me know. Send me a message on Telegram or WhatsApp. Uh, and I'll come back here yeah. and let's see the society. I'm here. I want to give an impact. I want to teach. I want to... Uh, alleviate poverty. Yeah. So Dr. Refuge Shaman here. I always like to say Sha yeah, Sha yeah, Sha yeah. <laughs>
Okay, thank you. I think the last thing um, 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 I, I will ask, and maybe I'll ask this off air, is I just want to get the name of, I want to get the name of the college that gave you the doctorate. Yeah. I, 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 let me check it yeah. here. You know, yeah. I was so excited at the time because 2016, it let me just check on. it. Yeah. Yes, yes. So uh, let's check it here. Let's check. So I don't, I don't like to talk things that are not here. Yeah. Yeah, 2017. Let's go to 2017. Let's see it live, me and yeah. you, because of now <laughs> you can talk and talk and talk. Let's yeah. see it together. So uh, let's go to it. Uh, and then, so this is now, um, and then, yeah, yeah, this is, yeah, let me just check it. So I'm going to my photos because I posted it on, on, my, on my thing so that you, you know that you are really talking to a, a legit, it's not a, 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 yeah, a yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's go to it. Yo, it's far though, but I'll find it. So now this institution invited me to say, no, come man. Uh, 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 and then there is even more. Yeah, this is the one. Now mm. you see, this is when I got it. So you see, I'm not just saying things. Let me show you first. Yeah, this is when I got it. Uh, this is yeah. This is when we, all of us we were there. Mm. So these are the other doctors as well. Mm. You see, my name is Derek Fidwe, which is Rev. Yeah. Honorary Doctor. You see, yeah. International Institute. Yeah. But let me just show also the camera. International Kamera. Institute. Yeah. Yeah. See, yeah. So it's not something that I just wake <laughs> up. <and laughs> <put me. laughs> Can you see the name? International mm. Institute something. It's just that you can't zoom properly. But you can yeah. see that there's a slip key there. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. And by the way, there's another university now in Liverpool yeah. who also want to honor me with a doctorate. So yeah. I'm expecting more another, another prestigious. <laughs> more prestigious, yeah. Because yeah. Yeah. there is more, there's more theological uh, side to that yeah. one. Yeah. Okay, all right. Well, thank you very much. Mm. Um, I think it's been an interesting conversation with Dr. Ref Wayne. <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to go celebrate yeah. FXPress's five years in Kenya. And we will catch you on the next episode and of Financially Correct. Those who Correct. want to maybe contact me. Oh, yes, yes. Um, yeah. Please. Yeah. yeah my, uh, my WhatsApp number is plus one nine one Why am I giving the WhatsApp number? I've got now maybe over 40, 50 uh, uh, messages and also profiles from people who are scamming uh, others with the fake, fake thing. So I'm seeing it with my own na uh, name. There's no other WhatsApp number besides that one. And my profiles on Instagram and Facebook or anywhere, you'll see that they're verified. Make sure mm. that you follow the, the real ref way yeah. and not the fake <laughs> ref way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. Thank you. Thank you and so much. Thank you, guys. Um, we will see you next time.